Previously on Life is Strange. Hey Kate. How are you doing? I'm here. Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. Got your back. I needed that. Um, uh, hey Kate. I brought your book. It's okay. Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? Nah, I do. I hate bullies. Got I your back. I hate bullies. David Madsen should know better. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Ooh, I can't believe them. Can I ask you a question? Mm -hmm. And please be honest. I will. Cross Absolutely, my heart. Honest Anything. answer. I need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. Oh, he hates me. I'll not buy that. Should I go to the police? Alright, so I <laughs> ignore my slip up from the previous part. Now, this is part two. Left y'all a little cliffhanger. Now, I thought about it. And I figured, we don't need proof. We know Nathan's already a punk with drugs, so, huh? <laughs> go say, please! You should definitely go to the police, Kate. I totally believe every word you say. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nathan Prescott is truly dangerous. He has a gun. Bless you, Max. I will go to the police, and also Principal Wells. Ooh. With you as my backup witness, they'll have to take us seriously now. Ooh. Backup witness? Well, I mean, Ooh. I believe you on everything, but... <sighs> We're still just spoiled punk students to the cops and faculty. I just think we need to be very careful here. Why? Careful of what? I need Nothing. to be careful. Except the Prescotts are a powerful family. I hope this won't backfire on us, that's all. Even though that rich bastard has earned some serious bad karma. He'll get it. You know what? I'll be back up. Shoot. Kate. No, Kate. Max. Shut your fucking mouth. Time out, Max. You actually told Kate to go to the police and the principal. After getting a scary text threat. I'm ready. We'll now fight them all. Now the police will definitely drag you into this shit. We'll give him a little right one, two, three combo with an uppercut. Alright, let's go. See you, Kate. Ciao, ciao. Hope you go to the cops. I'm ready. Alright, what now? Diner, right? All right, let's go. See you, Brooke. Samuel truly is a weirdo, but he is great at cleaning up. Sleep. Do 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 Samuel. do 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 Samuel. do 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 I do love the early morning. Everything is so calm. Is that and, right. and I can feel the animals waking up with me. You're getting a little creeper. So, what did you think about that freak snow shower yesterday? Another message from the earth to get our shit together. Oh, yeah. I will say that Samuel hasn't seen anyone. Why are you talking like to that a person? That's one thing I truly love about Arcadia Bay. It's all those cool animals in the forest. The squirrels always come in the morning for food. I can hear them whisper. What animals do you see in the forest? I saw a doe. Don't laugh, but I saw a doe that seemed to be looking right at me. Like it was trying to communicate. Oh, that's your spirit animal. Nothing weird there except that's you saw weird. yours. Could be a sign about your destiny. What do I know? My spirit animal is a squirrel. Yeah. I so don't want to get in the way okay. of the morning ritual. See you later. Of course you will. I, this guy's creepy. He's always starting to mumble himself. Get me out of here. Who is this? Hey, where are you with uh, Victoria? Hi, Taylor. Hi, Taylor. Just because you were nice to Victoria doesn't mean I have to be nice to you. <gasps> That's not fight, boy. I don't want to fight with you or Victoria. 
Instead of smack talk, let's just talk mm -hmm, mm -hmm, for mm -hmm. once. You're funny. Well, I'm not doing anything at the moment, so talk. I'm gonna talk about this one. Kate is really upset about the video. All this gossip is cruel. Boo hoo. That's what happens when you preach to everybody about sex. She'll live. Is that what happened? She talking about like don't do sex, and then next thing you know she got drugged. Why do you hang out with Victoria? She's pretty mean to you and Courtney, and she's bossy too. Look, you don't know her. I do, and she's one of the best friends you could have. Good. It's a bossy best friend. Yeah, I yeah. guess I've had mean bossy best friends too. Better than having mean bossy parents. I would love it if my mom was mean or bossy instead of sick, but whatever. Mom's We've sick. had our talk. Your mom's sick, girl. Hold on, we got we got to talk Taylor. more about this. Conversation over. Rachel owns the money. Owes me money, babe. Ah, Rachel's missing. So Tyler, Taylor, Taylor is sick, huh? Whoa, whoa. This is Nathan's father. This is a message that you know that attempts to slander and blackmail my son. Would not we do that with many lawyers and legal ramifications. You're not the first to invite to try this, so you're the last. Hey! Boy! Try to threaten me! Nice try. Nice try. It's over here. What's up, boy? Warren, what are you doing here? My boy. Nothing. Waiting for a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. Yeah, man. What's up, thanks. By the way, Respect. thank you for stepping in. You were pretty badass, Warren. I owe you. Oh, yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You put some muscle real and probably win. Hero. You stood up to a bully and it was mm -hmm. awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, she's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? She's just a pirate. She's just a pirate I used to know. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? Oh, I need to tell you, but I busted him. I busted I rat him, him out like a rat. yesterday with a gun. I'll give you the story later. Principal Wells is taking care of it now, I hope. No, he's not. You're fucking weak. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Let's go ape! Let's go! I'm down! Yes, that's exactly what I need. I love those old school ape films. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool. I'll text you the info. Ooh, that's not a date. Hello. See you later, boy. <laughs> so the game is serious. It, it was always serious, but now it's again a little more serious tone with Kate. Potential rape victim. David talking to Nathan cannot be a good thing. This has something to do with Kate. Or Rachel. Or anyone. Or me. All right. Play some music. Let's go. Sleeping, we gotta get out of the bus soon. Hey, 
Is that the lighthouse way over there? Steals my lottery. Talk about going back in time. The diner looks exactly the same. What's up? Hi. You look lost. Close. Do you know if the bus has come yet? The left. online schedule isn't working. I just got off the bus. I just got off the school bus, but I'm sure the regular bus is coming too. Oh, that's a relief. <laughs> I can't be late for this job interview. Oh, yeah? I can't believe I have to take a bus all the way to Newport just to find a second job. That's terrible. Are things that bad here? Where are things good? I can't even afford to live here. Serious? Well, good luck. Thanks, I sure need it. This place is kind of run down. You're be cheap. Where's the diner? Diner's there? Oh, I want to explore though. I don't want to go that way. Okay. Game denying me my opportunity to explore. That's fine. That is fine. We shall go over here. And there's nothing over here. Mom will feed somebody there. <laughs> Doggy! Uh, stop that! Stop! No barking. Alright, never mind. There was something creepy about that guy and his dog. There's that dirty RV from the other day. Hmm. So that guy probably has to do with some, some. Ooh, flyers. Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. I'll read them. Yeah, we read them. Done. Good morning. Looks like you're ready to catch some serious fish. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I wish, young gal. Arcadia Bay just isn't the same fishing town I grew up in. I'll bet. Has the town changed much? By Neptune's beard it has. Who says that? Seems like a lifetime ago when I was king of the harbor. You have your own boat? I call her the Bali High. Bali High? I've kept a hold of her in these lean cool days. Might be all the time we've got left. I thought one of Arcadia Bay's main exports was fish. Oh, the fish used to jump onto my boat until the Prescotts and their finance fiends snapped up harbor rights. <gasps> the finance. Prescott, Prescott family. The Prescotts have a lot of power. Mm, rich they might rich people. The town Prescott Bay. If that tells you much. They own my school. They own my school. Crooks gain respect when they put their names on schools and libraries. Oh, yeah, true. Let's not get downcast. I hear the fish calling for Bali High. Do you? Never forget that old fishermen never die. We just smell that way. I'd love to learn more, but I have to Yeah, I need to get out of here. Happy fishing out there. Yeah, you got to like Friday until the whole fish is going to be flying through the hurricane. Alright, let's go. Excuse me. Table for two. Man, that smell of breakfast and the sound of clanging silverware ugh, makes me feel 13 again. Did you catch any big ones today? If by big you mean none, then sure. I caught a lot of big ones today. Now let me mourn over my eggs. Alright, chill out. Turn to speak. Dear lady. Hello there to you. Such a beautiful day, eh? Oh yeah, it's gonna Where's be a eggs super from? day. Enjoy your breakfast, eh? Hey, hey, hey I, I know the accents from somewhere. Kate Marsh, love you long time. Flush before pissing on the floor. That graffiti has been here forever. It's pretty funny. What was this say? I... Oh, I aim to misbehave. I was like, what's a Z? Rachel, it, Rachel A owns me. Gross. Ooh. What's this say? Another picture. 
fire walk with me? What's that supposed to mean? Another achievement. Ooh, dope. <laughs> okay. T-shirt, some postcards, some dude. What do you want? I feel like shit. Too much beer, so spare me, please. Oh. Let me suffer quietly. Oh, Hello, sir. Hi, young lady. You look a little lost. No, no, no. I'm hungry. Just hungry and thinking about what to eat. Now, that is a real problem at the uh, Two Wells. I can never decide. Joyce's pumpkin pie or grilled mac and grilled cheese? Grilled mac and cheese. What was I gonna do? Oh. So, you know Chloe? Sadly, we all know Chloe down at the station. <sighs> Poor Joyce. Just heard she even just got busted with partner room. How are you gonna talk to Joyce's daughter when she's right in front of you? Who told you? It's uh, only me, her, and his dad. I didn't hear it on the police scan. Joyce said the weed belonged to Chloe's friend, but I highly doubt that. Joyce didn't tell you who? She wouldn't. Afraid I'd go arrest somebody, as if I would. I'd just tell that loser to stay the hell away from Chloe, or else. I'm <laughs> just kidding. Besides, David Madsen's watching. Mm -hmm. Is she a friend of yours? Uh, I, I know her. I know her. Then you know she's a handful. Oh, yeah. Nah. I respect no, her. No, I think she's just had some bad luck. You have to create your own good luck. I think Chloe would rather destroy No, she would not. But I'm just a cop, not a psychologist. So. I respect Chloe, even though she ratted me out. How well do you know Joyce? I know her delicious grub. Everybody at the station comes here. Mm -hmm. We take care of this place like it's our own kitchen. And Joyce, like she's our... our mother. Okay, interesting. I guess you're friends with David Madsen. I wouldn't use that word. We know each other. Why do you ask? Yeah, he's a sketchy guy, man. He has a reputation, I'm you. He kinda has a reputation at Blackwell. I have respect for David. He served his country. He found his calling in Blackwell. Did he? At the station, we're happy David is exactly where he is. <laughs> Not everybody can be a cop. I have to go now. Enjoy your breakfast. Interesting. By the way, one thing I can tell you for certain is to stay away from that RV outside. What? I usually stay away from sketchy parked vehicles. I don't. Wise policy. The guy who lives in it, Frank, is pretty sketchy himself. That's all I can say for now. I should finish up cool my coffee. Though. I'll go see it. Tucker? All right. I don't feel like talking. I gotta deliver a load of breakfast to my stomach. My Over cat. Now. My cat and talk. What's up, Justin? Getting my coffee on before I cut class and Sounds destroy like some rails. Shouldn't you be taking photos? I am always taking photos. I am a camera. You crack me up, Maxer. Of course I'm baked. So I'll laugh at anything. Uh -huh. You should be studying, bad boy. So where's all your homework, school girl? School? Speaking of buds, I saw your bro Trevor sneaking out of Dana's room. Ooh. Trevor finally told me about him and Dana hooking up. He got there first, so I snooze and I lose. See you later, Max. That's cool. Hey, Trevor. Holla, Max. By the way, I know you saw me at the dorm. Yeah, yeah we did. Dana's room. Yeah, I saw you coming out of the I didn't know. See, I saw your jacket. Yeah, and I finally had to tell Justin because, well, he was into her too. How did Justin react? Justin. I got him blazed. He was cool. Nobody has secrets in Blackwell anyway. Yeah, we're not secrets. In class, Max. Isn't it Justin? The guy who he just. <laughs> kind of crazy. Ooh, food. We oh, yeah. Draw. Want everything. Eh, yeah, isn't my like real food? Give me the banjo, dude. Yeah. My kind of song. Do, 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 do. Hello. Uh, hello? Pardon moi, but What's you on your eye? my eyesight. Isn't everything in here with an eyesight? I don't care for your tone. You sound like Joyce. Yeah. How does Joyce sound? Bossy and smartass. Like you. Alright, I don't want to talk to this guy anymore. But hey, Joyce rules. Joyce rules? I want to be exactly like her when I grow up. Amen to this. Looks like you're on your way. 
I've been coming to this dive for three years, and Joyce gives me shit like it's going out of style. That's how she rolls. That's why I worship her every move. Good. I can't wait to see you flipping greasy bacon in a diner when you grow up. Exactly <laughs> like Joyce. Now pardon me while I get back to my coffee. These guys are in. up the wazoo. Joyce! Joyce! How to talk to you? What the freak? Can I walk in? Joyce! How to talk to you? Do we get our own booth? Oh yeah, that was, that was, that was right. Alright, so I'm just gonna sit right here. Joyce, uh, want some food please? No coffee, I want, I want some food. I'm not a coffee person. And there she is. Lovely young woman. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. It's nice to see you again. You look the same. Have an age of hmm. years. Like I'm still a waitress at Two Whales after all these years. No, like you still look pretty. Mm -hmm. Nice save, kid. You're still smart. But I wish you'd been here to help save Chloe. She got busted yesterday smoking out. Oh, yeah? Again. Again. Chloe told me that her stepfather hit her. I am sorry that was your introduction to David. I hope you get to know him on your terms, not Chloe's. He's a good man. He just... Yeah, He's I'm so sure he is since you married him, but... Don't be so harsh on Chloe. It's good you're here. I was hoping you could be a good influence in her I'm life I'm a now. terrible influencer. I will be. Promise. I know things were hard for you and Chloe. I feel bad I didn't call. Now my folks are in Seattle and I'm all alone at Blackwell. It's my karma. Karma, karma, karma. You did the right thing. You moved forward with your life. I Why did you moving backwards? William passed on. Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Anyway, I hope we see more of you. Chloe needs an old friend again. She had a friend, Rachel. Joyce, I am so sorry about William. Funny enough, I have great really. memories of him. I'm glad, Max. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Even Wonder if how he Chloe died. doesn't understand yet. Chloe changed. Chloe must have changed a lot during that time. Oh yeah, she did. Oh, she changed hit all the phases: expulsion, running away, drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. Complete the cycle. I see why. I mean, why? What did Chloe tell you? She had a big mouth. Well, Chloe texted me that David slapped her yesterday. He feels awful, and he will be punished. But Chloe will does push David, and it's not fair. He paid his dues in a war. He does care about her, along with all the students at Blackwell. Yeah, I care a little too much. There's no excuse. That's no excuse to hit a girl. He's an adult. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't like it either, Max. David swore it would never happen again. Sure He's does. true to his word. I just want us to be a family soon. I guess. I Too guess soon. it's all about time. I think you're right, Joyce. So, now let's get down to the nitty gritty. What do you want to eat? Ooh. Ooh. I want some bacon. I was dreaming about your bacon omelet. Heck yeah. Now finish your coffee. One coffee. Got some juice or something? Water? Never that coffee person. One bacon omelet for the young there lady. Graffiti. Warren must have been here. What does it say? X squared plus Y. Oh no, XH plus YH equals ZH. Kind of weird. The only thing that's changed on the menu are the prices. They get more expensive. What does that say? Where's my, uh. Where's my bacon omelet? Six dollars! The flip! Six dollars for a fucking bacon omelet? Hell no! Nah. We ain't paying that shit. Can I get some beer and bacon? This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep going back in time. Ooh, they got that singing fish. Drinking. Now our chug. Here we go. This is like fourth dimensional. Uh, One more. Incoming. Love. Thank you. 
I'm drooling like a baby. Six dollars. Still so can't weird. believe you're a woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe, ah. Uh... Mm, speak of the devil. And she will appear. Mom and Max together again. And Back Chloe at it. looking for a free meal. You put your whole damn college fund on your table. Oh, so Paco is a college. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. No, you're not. This is my treat to you for coming back to rescue my daughter. Nobody needs to rescue me. Cheater Unless herself. you set your room on fire smoking out. Oh, God, here it comes. Didn't you and Sergeant Pepper already read me the riot act last night? Call him David if you don't Sergeant want to be lectured. Peppers. <laughs> you only funny. get one damn slice of bacon a day. I got you, Chloe. You got my baby. You guys are still the same. Another reason to blow this town. Oh, that's your mother. What is this shit on the jukebox? Yeah, I want some banjo. Now that that's out of the way. Let's talk about your superpower. I don't have any explanation. And I can't explain why I saw that crazy fucking tornado. Come on, that's just a daydream. I want proof you can rewind time. What's that supposed to mean? This is all happening so fast. We'll start slow. Right here, now. Oh, yeah? Mm, I can tell you every single thing you have in your pocket. Oh, you thank you, never that. vision, dude? I don't even know what's in my pocket. Let me see. Okay, Max. Impress me. What? What? Chewing gum? Some old chewing gum? Nada. Not impressed. Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Sigs, That was beyond change. epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. Yeah, hold on. Let me just memorize this real quick. Okay, Max. Study every oh, item Lord. carefully and don't forget anything. All right. A bear keychain. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, six. That does that make sense? Okay, 25, 50, 75, 75, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 86 cents. And a parking warning ticket. Parking ticket? Is that it? Boom. Bop be impressed, girl. Watch this. Wait. Oh, come on. Come on. Hurry up. Hello? Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. What the heck was that? You got a parking ticket. A parking ticket. You know me well. But, what is the exact time I was busted? Oh my. It was like 10, right? 10.34 a.m. Booyah! Max can tell time! Even a broken clock is right twice a day. I am? Whatever the hell that means. You got some money? Some money. Clearly, I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? Eighty-six cents. Ooh. Eighty-six cents. Boom. That's right. Living large in Arcadia Bay. So that was cool. Show me more. Get some six. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? Seven. Ooh. Seven cigarettes. Genius. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Amazing. Something else in my pockets? Yeah, yeah, keys. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. It's a panda. I mean, was it really a panda? The panda only has like one black eye. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. Yeah, that's right. I'll take my tip now. That's right. That's right. Amaze balls. I literally Amaze just got balls. chills all over my neck. I'm a genius. Be impressed. You have powers. Ooh. I'll take that crap off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. How's the food, Max? Pretty good. Better than I remembered. Very good save. Man, I'm hungry like the wolf. Clearly. Respect. 
I'm freaking out about what just happened. You, you have to show me more. Something way cooler so I will believe you without any doubt. I will predict the future. Ooh. No way. Oh. Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Oh, Lord. Oops. Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. Well, now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. Uh, he started uh, it. I'm finishing it. That's a lie. That's a lie. Is that what you want me to do? That's the best song I've this heard This is yet. sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. Amen. So, what are you waiting for? I hold on, hold on. Watch this. Abacadabra. Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can dazzle Chloe with Come on, mad power. All right. I got you. I'm going to predict four events that will four. happen in the next thirty seconds or so. Uh, drop his mug. The trucker drops his mug, and Joyce rips him a new one. So, what happens next? What? The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio, and his partner in the car leaves without him. Yeah. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Joyce stop them. Justin and Trevor are fighting and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. Cute box so crazy as a cock as a cockroach. The jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. Amen. Okay. Here she is. Oops. Ooh. Did you break another cup? Oh, really? Go, no refill for you. Shh. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You called it. But he's off to go bust some skaters. Mm -hmm. You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Ooh. Trevor and Justin must be in love. You predicted a cockroach on the jukebox? I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. This One is nation, a toy. Under God, invisible. Some, 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 for all. Of course, it's a toy. The best toy ever. You can bang anyone with no strings attached. Excuse me. Rewind time and boom! It's like it never happened. Grow up. There's a time limit. I, it's, Maybe it's, you made a move on me, and I would never know. Yes, that's what I did. Oh. You can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. Play what? I don't have time. Oh, we should play though. You did not just say that. Uh, check out your nose. Too much blow? It's probably... Hey, are you okay? It's side effect. Too much excitement. See what happens when we hook up again? Then... Can we please clean that? Let's go to one of my secret lairs and fully test your power. You need a sidekick to guide you. <laughs> okay, girl wonder. Show me the way to Chloe's cave. Huh. Pretty cool. We, did we at least wipe the nose? Alright, well, I think that's a good enough for part two. For real this time. And, uh, yeah. See y'all in the next part.